Okay. Okay, so we are now in 1002, the second question under beginner. Virtual lands, as you are familiar with, they'll, they will tag certain packets as defined by 802.1Q. In this question, we need to open VLAN general .pcap ng. And the question is what VLAN is the communication happening on? This picture is showing you where the answer is. For some of these questions, we can answer them within CloudShark. This is one of those that we can do without having to download. So we can go to VLAN general.pcapng, almost at the bottom of the list. Here it is. Just click on the name, and CloudShark will open it for you. So you see the example of where the answer is. We are just looking for the number. What VLAN is the communication happening on? You should be able to see it right from the first packet. And again, you have an example picture from Wireshark that it is pretty similar in CloudShark. All right, we see more teams on the board. Awesome. So how to look for VLAN? So you see this example of frame number one, and you see that there's a section for 802.1Q. The answer is hiding right under these squares. So you can, in Cloud Shark, without having to download the file yourself, you should be able to find something very similar and see the ID number, which is the answer, the ID number of the VLAN that that packet was sent on. Look at that, we got more teams, awesome. Again, to answer this question, it's in the 802.1Q line. You can see it right in the first packet, just like the picture, packet number one. And you can see it within CloudShark without having to download the file yourself. where to get the packet. So you can click on Cloud Shark. I would right click it and open it in a new tab so that you have this tab available to you for the entire game. For this question, it is easy enough to answer within Cloud Shark. So you can just scroll all the way down, find VLAN general, because that's the trace file we're looking at in this question, as stated right here. If you are using Wireshark, you will need to download the file. If you are using Wireshark, click on the little I, click on download, and download the original file and then click on download file. Then you'll be able to open it locally and see the same thing that you'll see on CloudShark. You are downloading from CloudShark, from this link that I provided you up here in the bar. You will find all the trace files for this contest here in the trace files cloud chart link. Just right click this and open in a new window or new tab 
and you'll have the entire list of all the trace files. So every question, every 